let's go. I could like half feel the frustration in you, Alex. Half feel the frustration of what? Just in you. No. No, I was just enjoying the chips that I didn't finish it. Damn now I'll tell you what is a little bit frustrating though. What? I'm waiting for these cows to pop out some baby mammoths. That's a little frustrating. I should be able to rename this robot, and I should name it Fucking Bender. I don't think they'll let you. Really? Yeah, because it's not your robot. <laughs> <laughs> My robot, bitch. <laughs> oh, it stops at Fucking Bend. <laughs> There, I renamed them for you. Oh, I ran out of energetic alloy. Wow. Not energetic alloy. I'm going to shoot you, Alex. Oh, you are. I will. I will fucking shoot you. First off, you weren't here. You sure? Yeah, I know, because I can see you on the mini-map if you were. Second, you aren't going to do that. Because I need to be here when these mammoths come. What if I want to be there while the, when the mammoths come? I suppose you can do that, but if you shoot me, then the mammoths, uh, get tamed. Huh? Hmm? Just silence yourself, Charlie. I shall not. It's golden. Is Cassie still listening to us? I don't know. Yes. Hmm. Wow. She's creepy. Almost pedophilish. That damn pedophile. Y'all need to look up Panic at the Disco. Girls, girls, boys. No. No. The singer, the whole time he's singing the song, he's ass naked. And we want to okay. see that why. Yeah, It's why? funny. Like, he's sitting here singing, and you know that he has shorts on down low. But he's acting like he's naked. You're yelling into and the mic. And he's just singing this song, and he looks gay. And it's just the funniest thing can, ever. Can you please stop yelling in your mic? Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. There it is. Come on, you stupid cows. Push them mammoth babies out. There you are. Well, there's one baby mammoth. The other two will be coming very shortly, I'm sure. Well, note self. Don't try and shoot Alex while on the Phoenix. Did you shoot our Phoenix? I did shoot our Phoenix. Also... 
Why are you up there on the Phoenix, Charlie? I was coming to greet you. No, uh, you were coming to be a bitch. Charlie? Don't. Don't what? If you accidentally hit one of these cows, you may kill one of them. And they're... One, two of them are carrying mammoth embryos. <laughs> well, I thought at least two of them were. Okay, this one is carrying a mammoth embryo. Ah, oh, you moved, damn it. I had you away from the cows, and you moved. Well, I need to be alive and near the cows, John. Yeah, I know. Disappointing. This armor looks amazing. Ah, oh, damn it! I have two males. I need another one. Here, let 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 me do some operating on this one. I'll make it a female. Charlie, shut yeah. up. I'm just saying, I'll do it for you. What is this hmm. thing? That. Uh huh. That is an Elasmothere. Basically, he was the big <laughs> granddaddy of all rhinos. Oh. And he had one big ass horn that he could pierce through you with. He actually has com uh, damage comparable to a diamond sword. With one hell of a knockback. Where'd you get Chemical X from? What do you mean? How'd you make some chemical X so fast? Well, all you need is a water bottle and f pieces of obsidian. But strangely enough, when I fucking use the chemical X on the snow golems, it wouldn't turn them. Really? Yeah. So instead, I just went into creative and got myself a stack of snow mutant snow golem eggs and have just been... <gasps> instead. Did it work on whatever else they could work with? Um, I don't believe I tried. Uh, I mean, I thought that the mutant snow golems were guaranteed because, you know, you hit it with the potion, it's supposed to turn. But they didn't. So, yeah. I, I don't know. Wait, where, where the hell did those... Okay, there they are. So now it is double-layered capacitors with Vibrant Alloy and Glowstone to make octuple capacitors. I'm gonna only get six out of all of this. Eh, expected. I should probably go back to the end and check on that. Like, I don't even know if the end runs when I'm not there. I don't know if that digital miner runs when I'm not there. Well, if you could make yourself a dimensional anchor, it would definitely run. Well, I could easily get a dimensional anchor. That's not a problem. But I don't, I don't want it to run and fill up because it's not emptying anywhere. I don't want it to fill up and then crash the end. How does it look? Oh, there goes oh, Alex. I mean, Hello, there goes Cassie. Cassie. What about her? I know. She left. I know. Such a bitch, huh? <laughs> wonder why she left maybe she got tired of you being a bitch oh my bitch you're the bitch bitch how are you not a bitch Mm -hmm. 
Gosh darn, you're loud as fuck. Well, excuse me, I didn't have my mid-afternoon snooze. <laughs> I'll blame you. Neither did I. Alright, so. Drop 4 to 16 cores on the ground near it to activate it. 4 per charged block. Draconium block. Huh? Okay, Draconic cores activated for a few seconds after the initial activation will draw all nearby items towards it. Anything that yeah. is not a Draconic core will be destroyed. Now quickly place 1 to 4 depending on how many cores you dropped. Charge Draconium blocks near the heart. You will you will know it's working when you see the heart's energy targeting the charged draconium blocks and now stand back and watch the magic happen wait are you honestly attempting to revive the dragon while working? no 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 I'm, I'm reading how to make awakened draconium which is required for me to make the awakened draconium armor which is what is required to kill the chaos dragon hmm. what is the draconic staff of power uh, Pain's the master. Oh, that kind of looks cool. Draconic created ultimate weapon and destructive tool. Huh. So it's the sword, shovel, and pickaxe pretty much in one, and it makes a staff thingy, which kind of looks like a mace. What I really need to do is make the energy infuser. The energy what? The energy infuser. But that's gonna be fun as fuck. Well, fucking it's pretty fun. <laughs> no, no, I say that. The energy infuser looks absolutely fucking amazing. Don't get me wrong. Fuck, it's got these giant dragon wings that spin as you charge shit. But... Mm -hmm. and, and it's super fast, too. Like, it is the fastest charger in the entire game. And it, it's not exactly super cheap, though. It does require a enchanting table and a bunch of dra draconium. I believe it requires awakened draconium, too, which is what's the most annoying part. Let me make sure on that. So, that part does not. What about the other part? The particle generator actually does not. It just requires blaze rods, blocks of redstone, and a, and a draconic core. Which isn't too bad. No. What? I accidentally jumped and killed the cow that was just stating the mammoth. <laughs> How'd you do that? I just told you, Charlie. Wow. That does suck. Yeah. So, as I, I'm now reaching the realization I can only activate four blocks of Draconium at a time per Ender Dragon Heart. Uh, that means I'm actually collecting all this Draconium for nothing. I thought it was four stacks of Draconium that I could do at a time. Oh. Which is wrong, apparently. So you were stupid, and now you're paying the price. Just in time. I mean, I'm about to make four Draco um, draconium blocks for sure, and I'm about to go ahead and start charging them. I think I can make four. Yeah, I can make like seven. Hell, I can make 22 of these damn things. I mean, we have a bit of draconium now. Mm. I don't really need more. This is going to take a long time to charge, Alex. <laughs> Let's see. So it is, so it, it's, max charge rate is a thousand a tick. So that is the max charge rate that this thing does. 
Yeah. The draconium block to charge takes sets one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's nine zeros behind it. It's like one million RF that it takes. Mm-hmm. All right. 